Here in Fiji, we are blessed with a pristine environment. So the freshest organic produce, superfoods, and the freshest seafoods are in abundance here. Today, we're gonna to cook vegetarian. So if you're a vegan, vegetarian, or you just love fresh vegetables, Fiji has a world of exotic produce to offer. It's our soil, it's our air, it's our water that produces some of the most delicious tasting vegetables. One of them, at the moment, seasonal. When I first saw these, when I came to Fiji, I thought someone was selling umbrellas. But this is a product of, of the cane industry here. This is called Daruka. And Daruka is unopened flour of the young sugarcane shoot. We peel the first layer off and then we grill them grill them slowly over hot fire and they burn and essentially what happens is the flour inside steams and it cooks inside the sheath. So once that's done, cut these open. What I absolutely love about cooking vegetarian food here in Fiji is it's seasonal and we still are very fortunate to eat seasonal. So this is the flour at the very bottom, see that? It's got the flavor of cauliflower or asparagus. It's got the texture very crumbly texture. We need to take out the middle stem and then we're gonna cook with that. So what I'm gonna do is a Daruka salad. Daruka goes really well, just cooked gently, and then I'm gonna mix it with other vegetables. Our vegetable from the sea, this is Nama. Our sea grapes, some people call them sea caviar. These are a family of the seaweed. High, high, high in all sorts of nutritions. We traditionally eat this with seafoods in coconut milk, but as a vegan dish, this works really well with the Daruka as well. These are already, already cooked. We peeled these earlier. Give it a nice brown coating on the outside. I'm just gonna give it some color in the pan and it has the most unusual taste. A buttery cauliflower with nuts. That's the sort of the flavor profile of the Daruka. And when it's seasonal, you can just drive down any of the streets in Fiji, you can see them on the side of the road. It's about six to ten dollars Fiji, and a bundle like that can feed the whole family. It's still steaming hot, so we don't eat that center stem, as I showed you before, and it's very crumbly. So this also works well in saucy dishes. The Daruka acts as a sponge and it will soak up all the sauce that you put with it. So whether you cook it with creams or coconut milk, and I don't need to tell you the fiber content in this is what makes this one a really big winner. When you come to Fiji, you've got to try Daruka, if it's in season, if you're lucky enough. I've got the otter, which is the ferns, which we've used before. These are just raw, so just washed and raw. The salsa, a typical Indian edition, salsa, onions, tomatoes, some spring onions. This is just fresh coconut milk, I'm trying to get a really thick coconut milk. The way you can tell on the tins is you look at the percentage of water and coconut extract. The higher the coconut extract, the thicker the coconut milk. As a dressing, I want it quite thick. Some lemon, touch of salt, that's all it is. So this is what we call here a michi dressing. And this is the typical dressing that we would have with seafoods, meats, raw meats. I haven't added any salt to this dish. And the reason is, this is where the salt's coming from the sea grapes. So you're gonna get that burst of the ocean saltiness in there. If you've never had sea grapes here in Fiji, just imagine caviar or fish eggs, that texture when you, you bite them and it crunches, that's what this is. And so it doesn't matter what time of the year you come, you can always get sea grapes. At the market, Sue, this is the fermented coconut. We call it a kota, sour, our version of the yogurt, but with coconut as a different texture, as a different flavor profile on the plate. These are really perfect. You go to the markets, you can get the sea grapes, you can get the fermented coconut, a little bit of dried chili flakes, some coriander or cilantro, a touch of lemon. So you can see why I love cooking in Fiji when I've got access to such fresh produce. This is my Daruka sea grape salad. Delicious. We can't wait to welcome you back to our shores.